what I will make sure to do is I will be the person for as long as the state will have me that will be sure we operate effectively and efficiently and that every taxpayer in this room gets a return on the investment that you have made so that this building can be here for our citizens. That is the pledge I will make you. Now that that pledge is made, I know that the former president of Central Georgia Tech is here, Mike Moore. Dr. Moore, where are you? Would you come forward, please? recovery. 
and we work hard every day. Jobs are the number one thing that's on our mind. Can you imagine the closure of Ream and no tech school? Our population would have diminished a good bit quicker than it did before. So having the tech school here is, is vital, and they play a vital role in our economic recovery. I have spoken to young people here recently, and Dr. Allen and I had a brief conversation just a moment ago. He shares his same vision. We are so fortunate to live in a community where every citizen has an opportunity of higher education. You can go to GMC on the GED. You can go to Georgia College from there. You can get a master's degree at Georgia College. We see all these nursing students that are here. Uh, we have a doctorate of, of, of nursing there, so we understand uh, that particular segment of our community and how important it is. And you can come to Central Georgia Tech even after you go through um, a stint at GMC if you happen to know or, or have a particular skill that you can put to use that betters yourself in this community. I don't know how many communities in the country can offer that. And I feel fortunate to be able to live in a community where we can give those opportunities. Because our responsibility as local leaders and elected officials are, is creating opportunities, whether that's jobs or the opportunity for someone to better themselves. So the fact that the, the Central Georgia College, Central Tech is here, um, you know, part of the, the role of the, the Chamber of Commerce is to help in, in, in job creation and supporting the work of economic development efforts in our community. And we're excited to know that we do have a great place to educate the workforce of tomorrow. And we appreciate Central Florida Tech's um, commitment to developing and modifying and adapting um, their programming to meet the needs of, of tomorrow's jobs and creating that competitive workforce that we need. Thank you for supporting Matt and the Development Authority and all of the various efforts here in this community.